Bamberger with Bamberger Hockey. Today we're going to discuss the keys to goal scoring. The number one thing that we're going to work at is when we get to the blue line, we're going to continue to attack. Most kids, when they get to the blue line, they stop their feet from moving and they drift too far into the corner, taking themselves out of a shooting position. We are going to get to the blue line, keep our feet moving, attack dots in, and we're going to shoot in stride. The keys, again, are getting to the blue line, keeping your feet moving, attack dots in, and shooting in stride. You don't want to come in in a gliding position and shoot the puck. Shooting off the proper foot is also key, and that is, again, in stride. There's a couple different deception things that we're going to do of shooting off the back foot, but you do that, again, in stride. So we're going to go through some various drills with these guys to show you what we can do. In this drill, we're working attacking the blue line with speed, keeping our feet moving, shooting in stride, attacking dots in, and ending up on our foot closest to the net. A left-handed shot will come up and demonstrate the same thing. Again, his feet are moving, attacking the blue line, dots in, shooting in stride, ending up on his foot closest to the net. We're going to use the same side here, using the same principles that we did in the last one. He's getting to the blue line, keeping his feet moving, attacking dots in. The only difference is his landing foot. He's going to be landing on the foot away from the net. This causes deception to the goalie. If you can keep this shot in stride, here, same thing. He's coming in, keeping his feet moving. He does a little crossover here, but he ends up landing on the foot away from the net, short side shot. He could have caught the goalie leaning if his feet are moving. Another left-handed shot, doing the same thing, feet are moving. He uses a crossover step here. Maybe too much glide right there, but still a good shot. Here we're coming straight down the middle, and all we're going to work at is keeping our feet moving and shooting off our front foot in stride. Brady does a good job of staying in stride there. Now Parker's going to come in, and I think he probably has a little bit too much glide here at the one point. His feet are moving quick there, but right there there's a little bit too much glide before his release. And this next portion is from the other side, from behind. Brady does a good job, stays in stride, shoots off his front foot. Parker is going to come through, keeping his feet moving. Again, I'd either like to see a quicker release, or I would like to see him stay one more stride and then shoot the puck. Still not too bad. Dylan's going to come in here. He's going to keep his feet moving. He's going to end up shooting off his right foot because that will be his front foot as a left-handed player. Keeps his feet moving, a little crossover step, and a shot. In this drill, we're going to be doing the same thing, staying in stride, but now we're going to cause deception of shooting off that back foot. Good job by Brady right there, staying in stride. Parker's going to come in. He's going to keep his feet moving the entire time. He is going to stay in stride, and he's going to shoot that deceptive shot off his back foot. Now we're just going to come in from the other side, and you're going to end up landing on the foot closest to the net again. It's important. Attack dots in, keeping our feet moving. Left-handed shot ends up on his left foot. In stride, far side. Here comes a right-handed shot, doing the same thing. Keeps his feet moving, dots in. Good quick release to the other side. Now we're going to watch those same shots, but we're going to watch them in real speed. I'd like to see Brady attack the blue line a little bit faster here, but he still gets a good stride and a good shot off. When you first start these drills, make sure that you're working on your foot movement and not where the puck is actually going in the net. You want to make sure you're shooting in stride and off the foot that you're practicing on. We'll worry about shooters' illusions and ways to get the goalies to move a little bit later. But when you first start this, you have to concentrate on the speed, and you have to concentrate on the landing foot, and you have to concentrate on the release. Again, off the slow. front foot here, we're going in, staying in stride, shooting off the front foot. We got one more off the front foot here, staying in stride. Now we're going to go that deceptive, shooting off that back foot. The key to that is staying in stride and shooting. Don't get lazy with that back foot and go into your glide position too soon. Now just the opposite side, staying in stride, shooting off the foot closest to the net. 